for politics. Tip number four, set up a search for the candidate's name. Why? Same reason. You want to be able to see other tweets, your supporters, your other supporters ha are tweeting for them. Oftentimes they don't even use the um, right Twitter name, so this way you can find them either way. Now on Who's Tweet you can have 10 streams, but I just want to make this simple. So you go, you add a stream, you click on search. I'm I'm supporting Elizabeth Emkin, so I want to put her whole name in here. Now, if I only put at Elizabeth Emkin, I won't find the people that aren't changing her name to her Twitter handle. I want to find everybody that's using this. So create the stream. Okay, here's. Here's something from Next Generation with a link. Uh, I also recommend that you click on the links to make sure you want to share it and to also make sure that the link works. Okay? So here's a perfect example Vortex1155. So Elizabeth Emkin, he's using her name and her website, but not her Twitter handle. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to retweet it. I am going to put the at symbol in front of her name. I'm going to change this to the hashtag. We only need MKIN2012 once. And then I'm going to put an M instead of an R. MT means modified tweet. I modified this tweet from Vortex1155. I want him and all of his followers and anybody to know this is Elizabeth Emkin's Twitter handle and I want to put the hashtag in there hopefully to do two things model the behavior that I think is more effective on Twitter also to connect with Vortex1155 also to, to support that person in supporting the same candidate and to make this tweet even more visible. Now the uh, now I found um, a video by Politichix from four days ago that I didn't even notice because uh, I only checked this this search maybe once or twice a week. So I was able to tweet that out and it was an it was a good video. So this way you'll be able to see anybody who's who's tweeted, see Politic AM, my interview with Elizabeth Emkin. This person retweeted it and and didn't and also didn't even have the link. See the link is missing. If you scroll down you can get, you know, kind of a lot of choices and you can look, you know. This person used it. We want them to use the Twitter handle. So did this person. This one, it it was wrong. So say I want to uh, retweet them. I'm going to retweet it. I'm going to take this out. I'm going to change this Elizabeth Emkin to at Elizabeth Emkin. I'm going to add the Cassin hashtag. And most of the time, I also switch this to DiFi because it's shorter. You you want 120 characters or less so you could be retweeted. And then I'll um, say something like, cool. Okay? Does that make sense? If it doesn't make sense, you can always send me a tweet. You can always um, send me an instant message or something like that. See, now this person, see how it showed up in my mentions right here? They used an old school retweeting style. This is more effective. And I'm going to say thank you for the retweets.